Hey guys, welcome back, Rogue Glide Garage. I wanted to cover a topic that is very important when you do any kind of motorcycle trips, especially overnight trips. Storage and travel luggage is always a concern or limited. So I'm gonna show you what I did. There was a lot of them that I looked at. I couldn't touch them, so I really couldn't visualize all that I could shove in them. You know, seeing the square inches or the cubic cubic centimeters of the volume that they fill. In my mind, that doesn't tell me how many pairs of jeans are gonna fit in there. So I was at Walmart, just strolling through, getting some things for my trip, uh, some bungee cords and whatnot. And I looked down and bam, here she is. So I'd seen them all the way from 50 bucks to 300 bucks and everywhere in between. This one, was $29. So basically it's a giant dry bag with an opening on one end. It's completely sealed on top and sealed on the back side. It's got backpack straps so you can walk around with it on your shoulders. Now I did, I was doing nine days. So I got two of these at $29 a piece. That was awesome because I couldn't even get one of the others that I was looking at. What I did, being that you can only get into it one end, I packed things like days out, went down here. So I didn't have to unload it every time. Um, this kind of, you know, the everyday stuff was up at the top. And then it's got these clips. You roll up. You clip them closed. And then you zip this waterproof cover over that. So here it is, all sealed up. It's got covers over the zippers that are waterproof. And let me tell you, I went through some severe rain through Wyoming and it never leaked once. I had this, or I had this one in the back seat. I had another one on my tour pack. One thing that really concerned me was flapping. As you're running down the road, 80 miles an hour, all this stuff starts flapping. Well, how long is that gonna take before it's gonna be shred all over the interstate? So what I really did like about this, it's got these straps that are completely adjustable. So let's say you load it up and you get it on your bike and you just cinch these down and it's got them across the top around the bottom. So you can really snug it down to make it not flap. And it's a really thick, heavy material. Um, that really keeps its shape really well. There's backpack straps you can carry it like backpack. And then one thing that I really utilized, I've got them all tied back up now, but is the straps. It's got straps that I connected to my tour pack. It's the twist or the, the weave through and then pull snug. It's got four of them. I snugged them into my, my, the rack on my tour pack through wind and rain and heat. The heat was excessive. And this thing, you can't even tell, it looks like it came off the store shelf. Highly recommend it. If you're thinking about luggage and you don't wanna spend a lot of money, this was as effective as anybody else, if not more, cause I had more room. Walmart, $29, can't go wrong. I'll, I'll, cherry, I'll put the, the link in the description all right, guys, I just want to say thanks for joining. Please like and subscribe. I've got lots of content coming up. I hope you enjoy it. Leave comments. Let me know what you'd like to see. Let me know what I'm doing wrong, what I can improve on. Again, I've said it in the first video. I'm not doing this to get rich. It's I love motorcycles, and I want to share everything I, I can with somebody that it would help. Thanks a lot, guys.